Jets love this. Coming in free and gets a good clean shot on the QB and gets a sack. The Falcons will take the snap from the 30. And now Ryan's going to take off. Looking to the right side and throwing. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. The Falcons single for the timeout. And that's the first one they've used. First down following the long play. Going to try and scramble now. Matt Ryan with the long. Makes the catch. Touchdown. The fade route, it's a big part of every offense now in the NFL. We see it here. Look at the receiver. Pins the defender inside. Beautiful throw to the outside. Fade for a touchdown. Add the extra point. The kick is good. Ryan's going to watch his defense come out here in a moment. He was good for over 70 passing yards on that last touchdown drive. The Saints getting set to return the kickoff. running this one out and he's met head on right there at the 20 the Saints get ready to start their drive Drew Brees has it under center will go ground Thomas tackle down at the 22 Got to give a lot of credit to the defense. They were all over the front that time, and they only give up a short game. Second down. We've reached halftime, and we'll be sending it back to our studio and Larry Ridley as we continue with the NFL on EA Sports. All right, welcome to the Verizon Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. Let's take a look back now at the first half. The Falcons are happy to be in front, and they'll look to play another solid half of football. The Saints haven't played horribly, but will need to improve if they want to win this one. All right, let's take a look at some of the highlights from the first half. Midway through the second quarter. Catch is made after a quick pass, and he'll end up at their own 40-yard line before being tackled. Later on the drive, Rodgers got fantastic blocking up front, and he caps off the six-play drive with the score. Falcons go up by four. Falcons now late in the second. Jones is able to make the catch in trap, and he won't be brought down until he makes it to the 48-yard line. Still late in the first half, White's going to corral the deep ball, and a quick three-play drive ends with the score. The Falcons push their lead to 11. So that'll wrap it up for us here at the EA Sports Studio. We'll head back now to Atlanta for the start of the second half. Sparkly takes a knee in the end zone. The Saints are set for their next possession. Thomas lined up directly behind the quarterback here. And that's Dent in on the stop. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying you're tougher than you are and we're just going to come right at you. Thomas is taking the handoff. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game. The Saints from the 32. Breeze leans on his tight end this time. Jimmy Graham with the catch. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down, keep those chains moving, give yourself three more opportunities. They come out in the dime package. Risky throw in the double coverage there, but this will go incomplete. Quarterbacks love to see a receiver uh, have this type of play. Even though he doesn't make the catch, the effort is outstanding, and he's given everything he has to make that catch. 
coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. And they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Drew Brees has it under center. Here's the handoff out of the strong line. We don't always get to see defensive matchups these days, but today it's been exactly that. Low-scoring game, and it's because both defenses have really stepped up. That play is going to be challenged. Challenge flag is out. To review the play, the ruling on the field stands. The coach's challenge is not answered. The play on the field will stand. Yeah, that, that's a tough. You know, I think it was up to me in this situation in the game. I would not have challenged, knowing those timeouts, how important they are. We'll see if that lost timeout comes back and hurts him. They call his name again. Rams out wide on the left. Brees in shotgun formation. Throws to the right. Under fire on that throw. Nice job that time by the defense. Pressure on the quarterback. He does not have time to find an open guy, and it results in an incompletion. Cooks is going to get set in the slot for the snap. Third and ten. Makes the catch. That's a third down conversion, a rare sight so far today. That's a really good throw and catch, and they get the first down, Jim. That's what you want to do. Pick up that first down. Now you give your offense three more opportunities. The Saints take it from the 28. He'll go to the left. Thomas is taken down. Anytime you get in the red zone, you want to punch it in there and get seven points. Uh, they're being dominated today. They're down more than seven, but don't worry about it. Score here and just keep playing. First down at the 17. They're going to get him here for a sack. There's nothing worse to a quarterback than having an offensive lineman getting driven back in his way. That time, the right side of the line collapses, and it leads to a sack of the QB. The Saints will take the snap from the 25. Breeze and Colston, a famous combination for years. Well, even though they're down more than seven here, the offense down the red zone, it'll be good for them for the rest of this game, their confidence uh, for the offensive coach that they can punch this in for the touchdown. Third down and six. Has his man. Touchdown. And this game just got a whole lot more interesting. Nowadays, so many kids, they grow up, they want to be wide receivers. I don't blame them. They're out there, they get to catch the football, they get to score touchdowns, they get to do dances, and you're not really allowed to hit them either. What a job. He's looking to the right here on this throw. So they give up the touchdown, but they do not allow the two-point play. Yeah, good job that time by the defense. So quick and so ready for that play. They reacted very fast. That's why they stopped it. made right around the 25-yard line. They face first down. Matt Ryan will be taking this one from the gun, from the shotgun. And he's forced to the ground. Well, I know this feeling. When a blitzer's coming, nobody's there to block him. There's nothing you can do as a quarterback, but try to protect yourself because you're going down. Play fake. And he takes off. He makes the catch. Tackles made, and that'll move the chains. That's what you want to do. Just get a first down, especially when you're on top. Keep the clock moving. 
keep the defense guessing, make them react instead of attack. They'll hike it to him out of the shotgun. Scrambling out of the pocket. It's Douglas. And he spins away. The Falcons really got it going now. They got confidence. They got momentum. They got a small lead here in the second half. And that first down, what does it do? It just gives the offensive coordinator confidence. And, of course, this quarterback, he is always ready to go. The defense comes out of the dime. Here is the first snap of the final quarter. Airing it out. And Bird came very close to a pick. Looking ahead, the Falcons will be on the road in Cincinnati next week, while the Saints will be on the road in Cleveland. Second down coming up. to the ground. My gosh, you're talking about getting overpowered. I guess they were expecting a speed move. The right guard and right tackle are both pulled. They get run over and they give up a sack. Jackson takes his spot in the backfield. Falcons will take the snap from the 40. He's scrambling now. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. Coverage team won't get a chance this time as it bounces into the end zone. First down here. From the gun, Drew Brees ready for the snap. He'll stand back beyond the center in the gun. And he's taken down. Well, the right side, Jim, the right tackle and the right guard. They look confused. They don't know what to do, so they just get run over, and the quarterback falls down. After that sack, it's now second down and 17. This one's running out, and the defense knows it needs another stop. The tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. Well, I think we all know the situation here. It's a close game in the second half, and you're losing, but you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh. That opens up many more possibilities, what you can do on the offensive side. Good job by the offense. Almost intercepted. Just not a good decision by the quarterback. I mean, maybe on the sidelines they keep calling the wrong plays, but he's attacking the strength of this cover two defense. Don't do that. Throw where they're not. That's deep down the middle. These guys need to make something happen on offense. With time beginning to run out. Second down and ten. Throws the pass. The ball is out. The defense has the football. Made. You gotta protect the football. Hold on a minute. They're gonna stop play and take another look at that last one. Was the knee down, Phil, or was it a fumble first? I think what we need to do here, let's stop it when the knee hits the ground. And once we stop it, let's look at the football. Does he have possession of it completely at that time? If he does, then it's going to be down. The runner will be down the play, before the fumble the occurs. on the field is reversed. A replay upstairs overturns the call on the field. Yeah, good job by the officials upstairs seeing it, knowing there was a mistake on the field. That's what I love about the NFL. They're not afraid to admit, to say they made mistakes and turn them around. Pierre Thomas takes the handoff. Another third down conversion. The offense continues to come through in the clutch. The Saints look pretty confident out there on the field, don't they? And they're, they're very calm, and they should be. That first down, they're right in this game. Down a couple points here in the second half. Don't look down the field for that big play. Just keep marching. The Saints from the 37. The defense gets the set. Two minutes remaining, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Second down coming up. Time, obviously, a factor the rest of the way. 
the Saints will take the snap from the 45. He'll throw it over the middle. And nothing there as that was double covered. Phil, it's third down. They are in four down territory, and the defense knows that. Yeah, and it, you get a situation like this, Jim, on the defensive side, you need one of your pass rushes to come through and get on that quarterback. Finds Graham, and he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. He'll go for it on fourth down. Late stages. The Saints snap it at the 36. Got the completion. Ooh, they fail to pick up the first, and the ball will go back to the other side. Well, in the second half, when your team is losing, here's a fourth down situation, and you feel like you just got to go for it. I don't know if I agree with that call, but they try it. They come up short. That is deflating. The Falcons take it from the 28. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. They'll mark him at the 34. That's a timeout call. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. Here's the handoff. And this won't even get back to the line. They'll end up losing one. It'll be third down. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Ryan still has it. Out to the left. Brings it into his body. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. The Saints stops the clock in a hurry, trying to hold on to every precious second. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Toss play to Rodgers. They'll meet him this time behind the line. Got to give the defense some credit on first down. There's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. After running it, it's second down. Second and long, keeps it here, takes off with it. White's got it, first down. They come to the line of scrimmage, first down. The Falcons are going to use one of the two timeouts they have remaining. ready to play after calling a timeout. This play set up by the long gainer. Quick drop back. Roddy White makes the reception. Vaccaro takes him down. First down on the way. First down, they'll go back to the air. Julio Jones with a nice catch there. That ball had a lot on it. Falcons will take a second here. Talk things over as they call a timeout on second down. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Had it for just a second, but then it came out on contact. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. Just a quick drop back. It's a touchdown. job by the offense so little time left to drive down the field and score that just ices the game nice job by the whole football team today but especially on the offensive side the Falcons for the extra point he made it Lions going to watch his defense come out here in a moment he was good for over 70 passing yards on that last touchdown drive Falcons getting ready to kick it off.
Books has got it on the return. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. First down, offense ready for the snap. One more snap and we can call it a day. The pass down the field by Droop. It's intercepted, and that's going to end the comeback attempt. He's brought to a halt. You get that win week one, and it certainly takes a little bit of the edge off, doesn't it? Oh, no, it does more than that. It takes a lot of the edge off. Uh, when you win the opening day game, you just feel like, hey, we're going to win them all, and all that hard work, it was all worth it. And the following week, you're going to listen to the coach because he led you to that first victory. Memorable game this truly was. For Phil Sims, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game. Hello, everybody. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. In today's game, we have two incredible receivers from the 2011 NFL Draft going head-to-head. -head. It's A.J. Green going up against Julio Jones. Now let's head down to Jim Nance and Bill Sims. Falcons, Bengals, coming up on EA Sports. Week two, football on tap as we get set for today's game. Jim Nance and Phil Sims, partner, look forward to sharing a very special afternoon with you. Yeah, Jim, I think it's going to be special because we have two teams that have special players on their side, and it's uh, always fun to watch them to see how athletic and how wide open the NFL has become. So fans, they love it this way, so you're going to love this game. So that means Devin Hester will be back for the opening kick. The Bengals ready to get this action started. No return. The ball's coming out to the 20. At quarterback. He holds virtually every Atlanta record for single season and career records. Quarterback Matt Ryan 
Well, the Atlanta Falcons, they need to give Matt Ryan more protection. In 2013, he took a beating like no other quarterback in the National Football League. We know he's good. We know he's tough. But let's let him be great by protecting him. Here's our look at the Falcons offense. This is an efficient group. Last week, turning the football over just once. The Falcons from the 22. Gets away from the pressure. Oh, and almost picked off that time. Heading to the line for a third down play. And this was something they specialized in last week. Converting in these situations. Third down and eight. Getting away from the pressure. And he's going to be tackled. And that's going to bring us to fourth down. Aggressive play here early as the offense stays on the field on fourth down. Offense lines up here. The Falcons snap it at the 26. Ryan connects with Julio Jones on that one. That'll put them in what we call plus territory. Number 11. Early in this game, Phil, and already on the other side of the midfield strike. Nice job by the offense here. Good play calling, too, Jim. Mixing up the plays. The defense is off guard right now, and the offense is taking advantage of it. from the gun he's got the catch and that's a two-yard game well I guess the best thing to say there Jim is they completed the pass but it still did not get a first down the Bengals lined up in the nickel keeps churning ahead pass is made but the hit knocks the ball out incomplete. You gotta try to avoid this as a quarterback. Don't go off that back foot unless you have to. When you do, there's just no way you're gonna be as good if you had good balance. That time the throws off the mark. Falcons take it from the 43. Catch made. Still not taken down. They are all over them behind the line of scrimmage and a loss of one. Well, we see it more and more. Football thrown behind the line of scrimmage. They do at that time. Nice catch, but a loss of yards on the play. Fourth and nine to go, and they're going to go for it. Jones is lined up in the slot. The Falcons have it at the 44. This is going to set up a change of possession. Dalton's heading out now. Now an experienced quarterback with four years under his belt. Quarters formation here for the defense. Draw. And that's Dent in on the stop. Well, anytime you're talking about a successful run in the NFL, the running back is going to be a big part of that. Breaking tackles, but this time it was just the vision of the running back. He picked the right hole and picked up some nice yards. Dalton. Off, and there's only two yards to be found right there. And with that, let's take a look at the Bengals offense. They will be expecting far greater efficiency today. A week ago, they turned it over on three occasions. He'll get it again. And it's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. And it fires a football team up. The defense, third and short, they stop the run. Keeps the offense short of the first down. And look at the excitement on the defensive side. And a touchback. First down coming up. Steven Jackson lined up in the backfield. Ryan takes it from the gun. And that pass is deflected by Nelson. Boy, it must be hard just to knock the football down. That time he's in good position because you know the defender wanted to go for the interception, but he played it smart and knocked it down instead. Second and ten. Out of the pocket. Looking across the middle. Ryan hits Roddy White. They'll mark him at the 40. That's a nice job that time by the quarterback. He's forced out of the pocket, 
and when he moves, he's excellent throwing the football on the run and gets the completion. The Falcons will take the snap from the 40. Intercepted by Reggie Nelson. The tackle was made. 